Okay, so good morning everyone and welcome to the first day of uh, the third week. So yeah, we can start sharing for uh, for today I'm going to be the uh, I'm going to be the one who's going to make you talk, I guess. So yeah, let's go on maybe we can go by round or anyone who had was willing to talk first can go. So so far, how is the challenge going? What problems do you have? What challenges do you have? How is everything treating you? So let's talk. So today it's uh, Friday. It, it is going to be the last day for the carrier submission and uh, almost uh, around the last day for the technical submission too, since it is going to be by tomorrow. So is everyone ready for the submission? And maybe who is finding a problem on finding their partner for the carrier submissions also? So let's go on, guys. Okay, there is, is there, there is no one who is willing to go first. Should I just start to call names or later start from maybe Firomsa? Firomsa, let me. Firomsa, can you speak? Maybe if you're not able to speak, you can also write. Okay, maybe that we. I am. Am I audio? Am I not audio? You guys? Maybe you could show me that you guys are alive. Okay. Thank you, Sarah. God, we maybe can we proceed with you? Actually, start with you. Okay. Uh, good morning, everyone. Uh, yeah, regarding the the challenges, I have already almost completing the uh, final submission. Regarding the interim submission, we have already submitted on uh, uh, Wednesday, but for the final submission, I have already completed. But uh, regarding this uh, career challenge, still I am, you know, facing to get the the peer. So yesterday I have uh, just dropped my message on Slack for for Henok, but still I'm waiting for him. Maybe if he has time today, we will uh, make a Google meeting and then. I uh, hope I will arrange uh, today regarding this uh, mentorship challenge. Then I hope I will report it by today if I can manage it. And if uh, the, prim the problem will continue, that means if I'm not going to get him, maybe it could be tomorrow. Uh, together with the final report, I will try to manage it. Yeah, this is all from my side. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Tarafa. Uh, it is really nice to hear from you. And yeah, so uh, so uh, yeah, thank you, Tarafa. To you. It, it is nice to hear from you. And like uh, maybe I think it's most of you guys are having this problem of finding your peers. Maybe since they're not going to be not ever not everyone going to be active uh, yeah that is going to be a problem just i am not sure what the career challenge is but uh, maybe you can finish your part so that okay it is mentorship i know but maybe at the end of the day if you're not going to be able to communicate with your peer then you're going to submit at least your part let's keep uh, trying to reach out to your uh, peer okay and thank you, Tarafa. Okay, uh, let's go to maybe Ruyi has asked about task four in the challenge book. So, uh, okay, before that, there is Franco. If Franco, you can go on. Okay, thank you. Uh, I'm new for this channel, uh, but uh, still, I can't uh, know what can I do. If you have brief description of uh, activities, what should I do? Uh, I need to know that. Okay. 
for what part? For which part are you asking, Franco? Uh, I'm new for this channel also for this. That's why I'm asking. Um, I'm trying to know the general information and what's going on. this challenge? Like for the whole challenge? Yeah, how about, yeah, how about the challenges or the assignments or what are given, what we are going to submit? I have no idea. Okay, Franco. Uh, have you got the chance to go over the challenge document of week three? Have you tried to look? No, at I haven't. It? Okay, so. so where did I be? What? I, okay, I'm going to send the link here too, but mostly you're going to find the link for the challenge document on Slack. So for every week, there is, for week three, there is a week three, uh, there will be a week three channel, and we're going to communicate everything about that week on that channel. For now, you can check this link for using the email that you've registered in Tien Academy, and you can find the challenge document. I can also maybe go uh, cover briefly what the challenge document is saying if you want, but first you need to look at the challenge document and then you, yeah, it would be, you know, uh, somehow possible to answer the questions or the confusions. Yeah. And uh, are you opening the document, Franco? Yeah, I'm opening the document. Yeah, try to like uh, at least that uh, like while trying while we're going through this stand up, try to look at it, and I will be describing a little bit, or I will give you the introduction for the document at the end of the stand up, or like later. Okay, in this session. Okay. Okay. There is a equation from Uriyagi. Where is task four, which is there is an optional task, which is task four. It reports. Uh, aims to have trainees brief their colleague on how to use LLMs for search, covering the how and different LLMs and giving his example. So it's a video showing how to use LLMs for search as bonus. So um, have you attained, maybe if you can speak, have you attained decisions about introduction to LLM and how to search and prompt using LLMs? Have you attained that? Sorry, uh, are you with me? No, no, no. Like you keep going uh, through the document, and we will get back. I, I will get back with you after some descriptions. Maybe for Toruye, I was looking for Toruye. Like, okay. So on that challenge, we were seeing how to use the limbs for searching, and for uh, we, we were also seeing introduction. So what is what task for is asking is that you're going to make an introduction for a friend or for a person who is not that familiar with the limbs. So you're going to include the introduction, maybe what type of LLMs there are, or one of the major LLMs that you recommend for people to use, and how to use them, how to prompt them, and for what purpose to use them. So if you need for uh, reporting, so you it is better to use this type of LLM. If you need it for Google search thing, it is good to use to replace Google search. Um, work it is good to use this this type of llm and if it is for coding you're going to it is good to use this type of llm that is the description that you're going to include on the uh on the report okay so you can include the introduction the types of llms that you know and um what type of llm do you recommend for specific purpose to, to you. so you're going to prepare a, a, a report for that or a pda form in a pda format that is what task four is asking. And the optional one is just a uh, loop video. So it's optional, but it's you can prepare a video how that is how to use a little for search. So it is going to be a bonus. So a loom it's just uh, a platform or a site that is going to help you to uh risk record <coughs> record yourself. So you can use that to record yourself while talking about the introduction to a little okay uh do you, do you get my uh, do i get your question right or is is your question answered okay thank you so Tarafa, i have uploaded actually both of the documents for the introduction and also for um okay three for both both for the introduction and for the searching and prompting purpose are you sure that you have searched you have checked properly or I, i'm also going to search it now uh, check it actually, but I have shared a presentation on that day.
Piromsa, you can go. Also, Tarraka, I'm going to make sure, like in order to read. Okay, okay thank you all. Uh, uh, I haven't uh, uh, more idea, but I have some idea on assignment or document challenges. I just uh, I think uh, there is peer mentorship uh, assignment challenges. Uh, can we do uh, uh, with whomever we went or how we can do with other peers or uh, the peer which is uh, associated with the names within our names or uh, others? Okay, uh, Firomsa, uh, this question is going to be for Margaret actually. She is going to be the right person to ask about the career challenge. But um, uh, I will make sure I will ask her too. But also, I would really recommend if you can talk to her or if you can DM her in Slack and ask her. Or I am going to, I will also ask her now in Slack. Firomsa. Uh, I think for Tarafa, maybe for the question that I have answered earlier, for like for the same question, the peering thing. Maybe if it is not going to be possible to do the assignment without having a peer, then uh, I don't know, I'm not sure what solution do we have, but I try to maybe try to get another person. Like Firomsa said, that is going to be, I think a good thing, uh, having a peer that you know uh, is going to be a lie. So uh, let's make sure, or let's ask uh, Margaret about that. I will also ask her if she answered. I will just let you know in this uh, session. Okay, if you don't. Thank you. Okay. So meanwhile, let's see if there is another person who want to go. Uh, maybe we'll be shut. Can you share us your progress and how everything is going in, if there's any confusion? Bhavishat, can you speak? If, for people who cannot speak, maybe you can share us on the... You can share you can share us on the chat and also you can uh, yeah you can show us maybe some emojis i don't know but you can okay everything is going away wait okay Mushet. glad to hear that um maybe uh Kibru Alamu. just the care challenge okay just give me a minute to write for margarita Can you speak? Okay, bro, everything is going well. Okay, uh, glad to hear that. Okay. Uh, Edus Masala. Can you share us your progress and challenge if there are some challenges? Edus, can you speak or can you write? Okay, so uh, maybe for the career challenge or uh, for, and for the question Firam had asked before, uh, you can peer with whomever you want. If you're not going to get uh, your peer online or if it is not possible to contact them, then uh, try to peer with a person that is also free or that is also having the same problem as you and who is going to be online. So try to peer with those person, it is possible. Uh, and if you're not uh, for, if there's another question or, uh, uh, that, that person is uh, either inactive or active. Uh, I don't know him. 
uh, but uh, uh, I try to do uh, the person I uh, went to with another person or which is active on this like yeah, okay, I understand. But for the first step, I mean, I prefer if it is it is going to be good if you can try to reach out for the person that you are already peered to, because at the end of the day, you you know, uh, we don't need anyone to be uh, to left alone to be left alone. Okay, so try to reach a person that you that you are peered. But if it, if it is not possible to reach out for them, then try to uh, get paired with the person that you know. It is. It's okay. 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 This is for everyone who have a confusion on the career challenge. And if there's another problem, again, as I have said, you can reach out for Margaret. Okay. Shedrak, everything is going great. Just that I don't use to have enough time for my challenge, but I will try my best. Okay, Shedrak, maybe for those type of problems, try to, you know, try to use uh, a wise method or, you know, if you have if you're going to be if you don't if you're not going to have that much time at end, so try to use uh, the shortest method that you can maybe watching the videos or uh, just going through the challenge documents properly and uh, or reach on, reaching out for the tutors and for a friend try to use those methods i think tarifa had raised his hand before uh, eric had uh, written on the chat so, so like let's go with Tarifa. okay Tarifa. Yeah, thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, maybe I shouldn't wait for my peer because he may not have time. Even I couldn't find him on this uh, uh, meeting. So uh, maybe someone, if if someone is volunteer to to peer with me, I'm okay. Uh, today I'm free. So if someone who has no peer like me, so we can do by today. You can put uh, your email or something that can communicate on Slack or or you can put in the message section so that you can make a connection. Thank you. Okay, that, that is a good call. Yeah, I, I was also thinking if there's, uh, if you can also, you, you can see everyone. So people who are here are probably active, so you can also do it here. Uh, Eric, um, everything is going well and I'm working well, my peer mentor. I'm working well, my peer mentor to work on career challenge. I hope that we will complete it by tomorrow. Yeah, I hope that too, Eric. Good luck with that. Is the career submission for tomorrow, you guys? Is it for tomorrow? Someone can answer me, please. Yes, I think it's yes. Okay, I thought it was for today. So if that is the case, then you guys have time for that. And yeah, good luck with that, Eric. Firomsa, my peer mentor is Groom by Gabrai. And how can I contact him? You can uh, write him on Slack. But according to my information, he might not answer you that fast. Uh, he might answer you uh, at the night time or something after a lot of hours. I, I don't think that he, he is uh, that active. Okay, so try to write him. But meanwhile, if you feel like you're going to get late, uh, then try to reach out for other person but for everyone who are trying to reach out who, who are trying to reach out their peers you can just dm them on slack okay you can find them on the slacks on the first place so you can write them there for themselves individually another question or not all the question actually uh mm, who want to go next? Firomsa, can I do with other peer, please? So, I like what my fear is that uh, at the end, if, uh, for example, if Gabra is, is ready to do the task or if he's available, then he's going to be left alone. That is my fear. So, um, what I'm trying to recommend is like try to give them uh, maybe write for Gurmai now on Slack and give him like uh, one hour or two hours. And for after that, if he's not going to answer you, then maybe so, here Taraf had a like, call for uh, some payment, so you can pay off with Taraf. But if Grima had answered, then it is good to just do it there. So that is my recommendation, Firumsa. Toruye, I joined the team this week, and it is challenging for me to follow up on my assignments. 
Okay, Turi, for first, we're glad that you have joined us. And um, yeah, it might be, yeah, that is most of the trainees had this experience on week one. So it's not, it might not going to be that easy if, if, if it is, if this is your first week, but yeah, you can DM for everyone, for the tutors and for your peers, for everyone on Slack, if you have any question. As your first starting point, you're going to start with the challenge document, everyone here. If there is a confusion on the first place, then you're going to go and refer the challenge document and then ask, okay? So uh, like everything is listed there. Uh, the tasks well, the tasks are probably most of the time divided in four or five so and you're going to make during trim submission maybe task one and two and the final from task one to task five or task three to task five uh it's not it, it depends on the challenge document so go try to go through the, the challenge document on details and try to refer for the sessions for for the sessions and then also try to reach out for us for the tutors and for um your peers for, for the for other trainees. So you're going to be okay with that. You're going to be able to handle that really, I believe that. And try to reach out for us if you have any question also. Also you can mention here okay Tori, you can mention here if you have if you had already go through the challenge document and if you still have a question, you can also mention it now mention it now. Kebru, uh, I was paired with Kedis Veleta for the mentorship program. However, she has not submitted tasks one and two. She has informed me that she will not be able to continue the mentorship with me. That's nice. I mean, what I mean by nice is so that is like a clear answer. Okay, so Kebru Alamu, so now you are open to be paired with another person. So if there is anyone who's having this type of uh, challenge or like having a problem with finding their peers, also just as you're going to contact with and Rafa also try to contact Kabru. So, yeah. Uh, maybe if there's another person like Bezawit, maybe do you have, are you able to contact your peer? Bezawit, can you speak? Or you can write? Uh, sure. Yeah, I got my peer and have done uh, our assignments. Now I'm, I just have to do the slide one, yeah? Okay, then okay, just I'm trying to just find a person who is not uh, also able to find their peers, uh, then who they can be paired with Kibru Alam. Okay, Franco. Uh, I'm seeing the document you have uh, uh, sent me, the link, but uh, if you have a, a time, if it's possible, uh, a little description, I need a little description about the documents. Okay, so uh, as you can see the, on the title, the, the core point of this challenge or this week's challenge is to incorporate financial analysis with data gathering via LLA. So if you have participated the other weeks or if you haven't also, it, it's, it is not going to be direct role playing, but uh, we usually give you a data. If you're going to make a data analysis, we usually give you a, a data. But what is unique on this week's challenge is that you're going we are going to give you the situations or the, the scenario or the data that we are expecting. And you're going to search for the data or you're going to bring the data by yourself from LLMs, okay? By so like LLMs, it means by using different types of AI tools like ChatGPT, Gemini, we have tried to go over every AIs and Copilot specifically, actually. Uh, Copilot is mentioned here, so you are expected to bring the data from that. So you're going to also the prompts are mentioned here. So using those prompts, so there are as you can see. Uh, maybe you can also tell me what you've understood from the challenge. Have you checked the magnificent seven companies or stocks? Oh. Yes. So those are the companies. So that you you're going to choose. Actually, there there are the financial indicators, seven financial indicators, and you're going to, to choose I think three of them. So the core point of this week is you're going to make an analysis for the stock market or for their growth or depending on the financial indicator, you're going to make an, an analysis of that company or those companies that are mentioned on the Magnificent 7. Uh, and you're going to estimate that from, you're going to collect a data from 2018 to 2023. And depending on that, 
you're going to make analysis in which year where they are where those companies were doing well or where they where their gross capital was growing and things like that you will, you will make that kind of analysis and then the core point is you're going to decide which company does have is going to do good or is going to do the best for uh the next one okay there is a scenario that you might read on um, i think on the first page there is you know some related things uh, okay yeah on the phase one you can read that you are a junior employee at major ice cream company and your responsibility as in the customer service department and when the company owner sister is visiting you overhear her speaking about 10,000 USD that she wants to invest into a leading technology company in the US stock market so the point is you uh so like when the, there is the company owner sister the, the sister is not that the point that uh, like there is that company owner and she is trying to invest ten thousand dollars and so you're going to tell her which company is going to be good for her to invest so that she's going to be a profitable for the rest of the years or for the coming years okay so those data will those conclusions or those predictions will depend on the previous uh, performance of those companies so you're going to evaluate their performance depending on the financial indicator that are listed so from the seven financial indicator you're going to pick three of the financial indicators and depending on those financial indicators you're going to do an analysis for all of the company which are for the seven company uh using the data that you have collected from early names okay so at the end what we what you what we are expecting from you is that a recommendation or a like a prediction or an advice for the company's owner in order to invest on the specific company because you feel like they are going to be more profitable on the coming years so that is the whole point of the challenge in short franco i would say yeah thank you very much so when when will be the last date of submission? That is going to be by tomorrow. Wednesday was the interim submission, but I really, if you haven't done the interim submission too, I really encourage I will encourage you to do both the interim submissions and the final submission by tomorrow. Okay. Also, again, this, for every submission and for every deadline, that is mentioned on the challenge document. So on the submission page, you're, you're going to get on the submission part, just search for the submission part on the challenge document. You're going to get when is going to be the deadline and also what are we expecting from all the challenge, what are we expecting, what parts are we expecting for the final submission and what parts are we expecting for the interim submission. So both the interim and the final submission are listed there and what we are expecting are listed there and you're make, going to make the submission depending on that. And also don't forget to share us the right link. And also don't forget to give us an access for the link that you're going to provide. And okay, thank if you have any question, try to reach out for us. Uh, uh, we will answer you anything, Frank. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, so uh, I could be sparing with Fironza. Okay, very nice. Uh, anyone who want to go next? So how we addressed uh, everyone's opinion and question and doubts. Maybe Matilda, Taden, Wali are some of the people who haven't talked yet. Are we good? The people that have called your name, maybe you can show us an emoji if you're okay. Or maybe you can speak up if you have any doubt. Okay, Matilda is okay. Okay, then I think. Uh, okay, if that is the case, then we can end up the session here. Thank you everyone for being here and thank you for being part of this challenge. Okay. Goodbye and try to reach out for us if there's any confusion. Goodbye, everyone, and good, good morning from here. I joined late. Hello. I'm sorry. Yeah, Emilia is here. Okay, Emilia, it's okay. All right, bye. Have a good day. Have a good day. All.